Hello, welcome back to my channel. This is Shasha SJ. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank you so much for coming by today. Today we are going to make another DIY from the Dollar Tree. I am so excited to show you guys these. And to be honest, it's never been planned. I have no practice on this one. I just look on some inspiration and there you go. Let's get into this and let's dig in and Everything I use in there are from the Dollar Tree beside the bow, okay? So hopefully you will get inspired and you'll make one of these. So here we go, let's get started. All right, first what we are going to need is a rock, mini stocking, wine, bottle bag remember guys everything that I have in here is from the Dollar Tree beside this chipboard I got this hidden in my drawers already so chipboard or you can use a cereal box you can use that too this one elf hat and another hat and of course this little guy from the Dollar Tree so we are going to make something which I don't even know <laughs> so we'll see how it goes so bear with me okay guys alright first we are going to work on this little guy as you can see this is a little bit flimsy and I want this a little bit strong or fluffy or has something inside and I think I'm going to fill this in and of course I forgot to tell you that we need a pipe all right so this is optional if you don't want this you can remove it on your list right now I'm going to remove this because I don't want to cut it yet because I'm going to work on something so stay with me guys I have no plan right now about what I'm trying to make so I have something in mind but no plan at all <laughs> all right so I'm so sorry okay now I'm going to fill this up and I hope it will work out well all right so I have this little things that you in your pillows or somehow you can have this on your pillow what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to fill this up in here. Alright, so since we almost put a stuffed inside on the elf's legs, like almost on the ankle, what we are going to, what I'm planning to do is I'm going to get this pipe and I'm going to twist it down. I, I grabbed two. All right, so then I can put this inside here on the elf's legs so they're more stronger, right there. And I'm going to continue filling this up I think we're almost done and there you go and I finished already the two legs of the elf it's a little bit fluffy now and what you need to do and what I'm going to do is I'm going to attach this on the elf's um, right here at the bottom all right remember guys earlier is um, the elves legs are used to be this one are facing this way and facing that way it was attached like that but I'm going to attach it this way like it's facing like that but like that you know and I'm going to attach this back to the elves body okay <laughs> So 
there is our elf's legs. It's more fluffy. And let's put this one aside. Next, I'm going to grab the elf's hat. And I'm going to cut this one down here. All right, let's put this one aside. And I'm going to turn this inside out. And I'm going to glue this in this corner to make them stronger. Just like that. And what I'm trying to do is I'm going to close this part and we'll see how it goes, okay? Alright, since this side is already glued, I'm going to make an angle right here like a triangle. And I will glue this in the side like so. All right. And then let's turn it inside out. And it creates that little corner on that side and I'm going to cut a piece of cardboard down there in the bottom so they're more sturdy I try to measure I like to eyeball all the time so I just measure it up just like that and I'm going to use my pencil or pen to put this one inside the hat there you go there and it's more flat and I'm going to glue that so they're steady there you go it's more flatter and nice and then they have a thing down there and then I'm going to put a rock down here and I will put this paper down here there you go and if you have a red felt you can cover this up I don't have a red felt or either green so I'm just going to use the pink just like that to cover this whole thing all right and I'm just going to glue them in there and just put them in there okay So they are more sturdy now and nicer and as you can see it is flat at the bottom down here so we'll see how this one finished next I'm going to grab my elf and I'm going to cut this I know I'm sorry I have to cut this off and I'm going to put his body down here okay so I hope I did it right. I am so sorry. I'm sorry. All right, and I'm just going to push this one in and I'm going to close this down. And I'm 
going to glue him down here. And check this out guys. I got candy. I'm going to put a candies down here. So it feels like he is digging in to some candies. And there it is. The elf is trying to go inside and dig for more in that little elf basket of chocolates and I'm going to show you a closer look, okay? This time we are going to make a Santa one, but we are going to build something from here. <laughs> so, finger crossed for me guys, because I have no plan for this at all. So, that's from that. I honestly don't have plan guys every time when I challenge myself. It's something, so hopefully it turns out right. This one I'm trying to do is I'm going to make this a Santa leg because I don't have a Santa leg, so I'm using this as my Santa leg, okay. <laughs> to cut this one and I'm going to cut this one in here oh my gosh you guys I have no plan on this at all I think I'm going to remove the white one down here this to be our Santa's boot. I'm going to fold it like this so it's not too thick. And I'm going to do it like that and do it like this to make it a boot. Okay? So stay with me. Alright, so as you can see, I just cut a smaller version of a boot style of a Santa boot and just cut them and it goes like that and I'm just going to glue this one in here all right so all we have to do is just turn this one inside out like so and I am going to use this right here all right so they look perfect now so all I have to do is just glue this one in here so they're a little bit steady to the spot 
of where I want it to be. And there you go. I just have to use my lint roller and I already make two mini shoes or boot and now we are going to glue this one the one that we just cut all right so next we are just going to glue this piece <laughs> So while this one is drying, let's put a stuffies inside here. Alright, I think they're all stuffed up now and it looks pretty. There you go. And let's try to turn this one inside out. So now let's stuff this one up with fuzzies again. I called it fuzzies. You can call it whatever you want. I call mine fuzzies. <laughs> and I'm going to get this pipe again. There you go. They're all twisted and sturdy. And I'm going to put some in here inside all right so all i have to do is just put this in here and i also made another one down here all right and then i'm going to grab the end part of this to be his little skirt down here and i'm going to glue this one here and glue this one here and i will put the stuffing in here and this is could be the santa legs okay <music> Next, we are going to grab our Santa hat and we are going to do the same way with that elf basket. And we're going to cut this one down here.
So now I'm just going to glue this one here. There you go. And I'm going to fill this up with rock and shredded paper, all right? So then I'm going to estimate again how big is this round-ish down here and I'm going to cut them out and then I'm going to glue this, okay? So stay with me. super nice and what I'm trying to do right now guys is I'm going to add this bow I make this long long time ago and I was like oh it's super cute to add this one and I'm going to cut this in half here and I'm going to put this on this and down, down here and I'm going to make a hole in this area. Just like so. Look at that. There you go. And look how pretty that is. I made this long, long time ago, guys. There you go. So now let me put this Santa, go this one here and tuck this in. So bear with me guys okay that's done as you can see super cute and pretty I will show you closer look when it's done and then I'm going to put this chocolate everything I got it from the Dollar Tree as well to show you the closer look of my finished project or DIY from the Dollar Tree.
yes that was so much fun and i do really enjoyed it and guess what guys those two baskets or those two that I just made, my boys took it downstairs to their bedroom. I think they just want the chocolates. <laughs> anyway, come back next time. See you soon.